So you are on track to raise 50 billion yen by the end of the year from various investors. What's the plan for 2020? We have some new products coming uh, in the OLED side, which we plan to put into the market uh, nearly. And uh, through that, I think uh, we can prove to the uh, outside that uh, our OLED technology has, is now ready for mass production and to serve our customers. And also, we have some unique uh, fingerprint uh, sensing technologies, which we also plan to put into the market soon. So these kinds of you know, growth drivers, I think, will help us to, you know, once we get the money, uh, come out strongly uh, to go into the black side as soon as possible. One of the biggest concerns uh, for Japan Display is the shift of mobile phone industry from LCD panels to OLED. What is your strategy? We're seeing some uh, changes regarding the uh, market trend and uh, due to the point that uh, the price competitiveness and also all of the customers now, many of the customers shifting from just selling the smartphones to rather shift to service or recurring business is uh, a key factor in the LCDs having a much more tendency to be used due to its price competitiveness. So I think um, those kinds of uh, changes uh, will help us going forward. And, uh, but having said that, we'll keep on building our technology in the OLED side as well and try to be flexible as well as much going forward. When it comes to the mobile phone business, of course, uh, CapEx is the name of the game. Uh, how do you plan to keep up with the companies that are spending billions of dollars on their own fabrication equipment? Well, uh, in the past, uh, even in the LCD, I think uh, we... Uh, didn't manage our balance sheet as well as uh, expected in these kind of big capex-oriented industries. So therefore, even entering the OLED market going forward, I think we should be more smart in rationalizing those things and uh, tying up with uh, business partners or financial partners so that we can uh, not use our balance sheet but enter into the market in a wise way.